I came to know of Ben's existence, if you could say, in 2015. But um, we started talking and getting really close, I think, in 2016, towards the end of January 2016. And, and it's just been amazing knowing him. I met him at a time in my life when things were not that great for me. And I was in a, a time and space where I'd kind of given up hope on life. And um, just knowing him and uh, loving him has been the best thing ever in my life. When I was young, I'd watched this movie called Practical Magic and um, I wrote down this list of everything I'd want in my perfect uh, guy, you know, the groom that I was going to spend the rest of my, my Prince Charming. And I'd written this list down. It was about kind, I wanted a guy who was kind, he should be very tall, I wanted kind eyes funny, would get my jokes, would totally understand how weird I was and, you know, meet my weirdness. And so we could be weird together. That's what I wanted every day of my life, to just be loved and, 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 and to love and to be happy and to have peace and joy. and. And, and there's this man just waiting to give everything to me. My life sort of took a new turn or a new beginning towards the end of 2015. And then in, uh, in, in February, it was February 8th, it was the day that everything changed. And I saw her getting off that train, it was just sparks flew and I was feeling jittery and nervous just like it was like a very first date, like a first ever date. I'd already fallen in love with, with Viv before actually meeting her. I remember after our, our first ever meeting that day driving back home or when I got back home I put something up on Facebook. I never post anything on Facebook. But this time I did, I just had a, I had an awesome day with the most awesome person. Close to two years later, we're engaged, we're about to get married and... Life's brilliant now. Life's really happy. The house is a home. We're all a family, all six of us. We're making it work. The next day when I went to work, I saw one of my work friends, I was telling him about this date uh, the week before. And when I saw him, I patted him on the back and I said, future wife, my future wife right there, I bet you. Writing this down right now is incredibly difficult. My heart has so many things it wants to say to you, but it won't all fit on this card here. I'm just going to say, Viveka, since we met, my life has never been so happy. Thank you so much for showing me that life can be good again. You are the most gorgeous woman alive, as smart as they come to. Fagan Park, showing up on my doorstep to surprise me. Birthday surprise in Goa, 9,000 kilometers you flew because I was sad. So many more to be had. I love you and forever will. Dearest Ben, you must have gotten ready by now looking every bit the handsome man you are. My knight in shining armor. I love you and I'm so excited to be yours. Our dreams together are finally coming true. It's the start of our adventure together, always and forever. How did I get so lucky that I get to have my Prince Charming and my happily ever after and with a dream family. Baby, you are it. I'm my always and forever. I crossed oceans to share your sorrow. How difficult would it be to walk across a lawn? I love you, baby. 
My life and my love is a dedication to you. I'll be the happiest woman alive if you wait for me at the other side of the lawn at Bradfield Park today at 4pm. Love, Vivica House.